in this section we are going to see how to multiply two logarithms to multiply two logarithms one of the two conditions we have on the board has to be met not both the conditions either the first condition or the second condition okay let's look at the condition so to multiply two logarithms uh, argument of the first logarithm and base of the second logarithm must be same otherwise base of the first logarithm and argument of the second logarithm must be same then only we'll be able to multiply two logarithms always will not be able to multiply two logarithms let's look at some examples here we have three examples okay let's look at the first example okay in the first example i'm going to check the first condition uh, that is i take the argument of the first logarithm and base of the second logarithm uh, both are same so we can multiply these two logarithms how we have to mark the part which covers argument of the first logarithm and the second logarithm along with its base now we have to remove this part and write logarithm with argument c and base b so log c to the base b so the product of two logarithms log a to the base b and log c to the base a is equal to log c to the base b let us look at the second example that is log a to the base b times log b to the base c okay here i'm going to check the first condition that is uh, argument of the first logarithm and base of the second logarithm a and c both of them are not same so we cannot apply the first condition here okay anyways uh, let's check the second condition base of the first logarithm is b argument of the second logarithm is also b they are same so we can multiply these two logarithms how we have to mark the part which covers the base of the first logarithm and the second logarithm along with its argument now we have to remove this part and write logarithm with argument a and base c so log a to the base c so the product of uh, the two logarithms log a to the base b and log b to the base c is equal to log a to the base c let's look at the third example that is log a to the base b times log c to the base d okay let me check the first condition i take the argument of the first logarithm a and base of the second logarithm d they are not same so the first condition is not met okay let's take the second condition uh, i take the base of the first logarithm that is b argument of the second logarithm c so they are also not same so the second condition is also not met so we will not be able to multiply these two logarithms and we have to leave it as it is